so good to see you. My name is Alejandro Bernard and this is the last and final video of my free beginning jazz piano course. So for the past four weeks we've been working on the tune Misty but unfortunately we have to cut that one off. Sometimes when I'm teaching and there's too much of a gap in between the last lesson I just like to start things fresh. We have a long way to go to finish that song. So I'm really sorry if you were invested in that tune and you didn't get to finish it. For anybody like that I've included the sheet music in the description okay so it's not a total loss. Today we're going to be learning the accompanimental chords to Will Me again by Frank Sinatra. It's great if you've got a vocalist with you or if you want to accompany yourself. That sheet music is also in the description. Thank you so much for listening. Let's get right into the lesson. Nice tune, right? It's not bad. So let's just work through the, through the first eight bars, okay? So the first chord you have, say so have G major seven. I just like to use two notes in the left hand. Will. Then it goes to this next chord. Meet again. B7 over F sharp, right? It's going to help us get to the next chord. Yeah, just like two notes in the left hand, three in the right. We'll meet again, don't know where. Here's an E13 chord, right? And then the next one we have is an E7 flat 13. When, because that's the melody, the melody is that note. Here we have A13, but I know we'll meet again. And I like this movement. Anytime you have a chord for two measures, you really want it either inverted or you want to just have some forward motion. So that's why I did this chord, um, A add two over C sharp. So that just extends our A7 sound. No, we'll meet again some sunny day. And this is like a two five in disguise. We have like C major seven over D. Uh, really, it's like A major, A minor seven. So we have like A minor seven over D, and then we put a nice little alteration, right? That just makes it really pretty. So I'll do that again. Here's the first eight measures really slowly. Three and will two three meet again. Two three don't know when. Two three don't know when. Two, but I know. Will be again some sunny day. Three and you can put this on if you want. Okay, and there's your first eight measures. So here's the next eight measures, and there's a pickup. So keep, and I think that's just really slick. You might not include that, right? You might just have the note by itself. So keep. But anytime I have that half step motion, I'll do the half step motion with the whole chord. So F sharp major seven, G major seven. Smiling through, this is basically the same as the first four. Just like you always do, two, three. And we do that progression, blue skies drive. We do it twice as fast. Blue skies drive, the dark clouds far away. All right, then I might make, because we have Do in the melody, this is a G chord, I'll do a quick theory lesson with you. Because you have Do in the melody, the major seven isn't gonna sound good. Here, let me, let me demonstrate. Right, and it 
it's subtle, you might get away with it because there's a lot of notes there, but really there's a minor ninth. Oh, and that doesn't sound very good. So anytime you have Do in the melody, we make it a 6-9 chord. Way. So I like that voicing better. It just works better with the melody, okay? So now we have another pickup going into the third section. So will you please say hello to the folks that I know? Tell them I won't be long. They'll be happy to know that as you saw me go, I was singing this song. All right, so we get a lot of mileage out of that A7 to C sharp add two over over uh, or A add two over C sharp, right? We get a lot of mileage out of that progression. It's just really, really beautiful. Okay, um, on this third section, I don't think there's too much to note. Yeah, just do that. Just play that, and then we get to the last part. We'll meet again, same as the first. Don't know where, don't know when. Okay, you might do that if you want to. It's kind of a nice little reharmonization, but you don't have to. Let me start that section again. So here's the final section, it goes like this. We'll meet again, don't know where, don't know when, but I know. Some sunny day. Right, and you can just take the right hand here and just do a nice little twinkle, you know, a little roll in the upper register to end the song, okay? And that's that's how you end it. So sheet music is in the description. You can just follow along my hands, listen to the original recording to get it into your fingers. But thank you everybody so much for tuning in. This has been a blast. It just shows me that I know I can do it and there's more great content to come your way. So I'll be seeing you soon, everybody. Take care.